Summer is here, it's hot as hell outside. I got my AC blasting here in the studio and that means that our style variety isn't as great as it is in the colder months when you can layer your clothes with cool jackets, long coats, hoodies. It's a lot more limiting in the summertime, right? Well, let me say this, if you nail the t-shirt and jeans look, you're golden. You're always going to look good no matter what because if I ask you what is the most basic fashion look in the world for a guy. The answer is probably gonna be a t-shirt and jeans, right? So how do we take this t-shirt and jeans look and make it less basic, less lazy, and more trendy, elevated, cool, and fresh? That is what I'm teaching you guys today. And by the way, if you're new here, hi, my name is Alex. And on this channel, we talk about men's fashion, grooming, men's hair, and so much more. If you're ready to look your best and boost your confidence in every way, shape, or form, hit the subscribe button below and join Join our YouTube family of over 3.2 million subscribers. In a t-shirt and jeans outfit, you need to nail the fit of the jeans. There's no way around it, right? You're not hiding the fit of your jeans with a jacket. Everyone can see it, so you have to nail. It needs to be perfect. I myself tend to wear slim fitting jeans. I like this because it makes your legs look longer. It also makes you look lean. Having said that, I know that there's a baggy trend happening right now, but honestly, I'm not buying it, man. I think a slim tapered pair of jeans is always gonna look good. The secret here is to have some room around your thighs, but have the jeans hug your calves and your ankles a little bit more. Basically, coming in kind of like a funnel, like a V. You don't want the jeans to be too tight though, especially around your junk area, because that looks bad, and let me tell you, it's very uncomfortable. Obviously, the length of the jeans is also gonna be very important. If you want your jeans to be versatile and classy, you need a length that isn't based on trends or a fad, all right? So this is what I suggest. Bring your low top shoes to the tailor and wear the shoes when you have the jeans on. The jeans should lightly braise the top of the sneakers. That is the ideal length for jeans. So that's why you need to bring the sneakers in so you can see where the if the jeans are touching the, the top of the sneakers. Now let's talk about the fit of your t-shirt. Again, you want this to be perfect. There is no room for error here because it's literally all you're wearing, a t-shirt and the jeans. If the t-shirt doesn't fit you well, your outfit is completely ruined. And the second thing that you should always look at when you're t-shirt shopping is the fabric. The fabric cannot be scratchy, low quality, because what happens is after a few washes, it's gonna fall apart. The fabric starts to pill. And for you guys that don't know, pilling is when you get those little balls of fabric, right? It looks, it looks horrible at a point that you can't even wear it out anymore. You gotta throw it away. If you have poor quality, sloppy essentials, then all of your outfits are gonna look bad. But if you have a set of tailored, well-fitting, high quality essentials, then any outfit that you put together will automatically look so much better. And as you guys probably know, I've just launched my brand new tops. We have tees and Henleys, long sleeve and short sleeve through ATOS apparel. So here's what makes ATOS different, starting with the fit. Instead of the generic boxy fit, our physique fit was engineered to enhance your body. So you're gonna see that we have a V tapered cut and fit that creates the effect of an athletic build without squeezing the body too much, which is not flattering. You can see that the side seam isn't like anything you've seen before. It goes from my armpit here to the front of my hips, right? And that creates the V shaped fit, which gives an optical illusion of a V taper as well without being too distracting. Hey guys, let me tell you about the fabric, man. I mean, look at it. It just it's so stretchy, it feels so nice. It feels really plush, nice and soft to the touch. It feels luxurious. And yes, this doesn't pill, it's pill resistant and it's polyester free, so no scratchiness even after washing. We literally went all out with this fabric. We wanted to nail the fabric and the fit of this t-shirt and let me tell you, it took a while, there's a lot of back and forth with the manufacturer, but we got it done. And if you're wondering about the sizing, I'm 5'9", for example, usually with normal brands, a small is a little too small, too tight, a medium, is a little too big, sometimes too long. I'm not that small of a guy. I shouldn't really be wearing a size small, right? And I'm sure so many of you guys go through the same thing because 5'9 is average height. In ATOS, I'm a size medium and it fits me perfectly. But here's the interesting thing. I'm wearing a large right now. I can actually go one size up and it fits slightly baggier, but it still fits me really well. Our tops just fit different. They fit extremely well. I could wear a medium if I want more of a you know, a tight fit around my body. Obviously the sleeves would be a little bit shorter or I could wear a large and go for a more relaxed fit. And to sweeten the deal, we're giving you a 15% discount on your entire order if you get three or more pieces. But there is one thing you gotta keep in mind. We are only taking pre-orders until July 24th 
which is when I'm posting this video, the day that I'm posting this video, that is it. After that, we're not taking any more orders because we gotta focus on customer service and order fulfillment. I wanna make sure that you guys are getting your products in time. So if you're on the fence, I highly recommend you click that first link below and get your ATOS apparel tops now. Otherwise, it's gonna be too late. And by the way, thank you so much for all the pre-orders coming in. I see them every day. My phone is going off right now and I see it. You guys are absolutely amazing. Thank you for the support. Thank you for believing in me and in my brand. I can't, I can't thank you guys enough. It means the world to me. If you'd like to pre-order, make sure to click that first link below and pre-order today. Now, what is the next thing that you can do to look amazing in a t-shirt and jeans? Well, very simple. I'm doing it right now. Can you tell? Accessories, right? Accessories will spruce everything up. It, it'll just add new dimension, new detail, more depth to your outfit, more conversation started. There are so many good reasons to wear accessories. Yes, a lot of guys just like to wear the watch and that is completely fine. I, of course, have gotten really comfortable with wearing rings. It took me a little while. At first, I wasn't sure if that's what I wanted, if it looked good on me. I'm like, my fingers don't look good. Are they fat? Are they long? It's all in your head. That's what I'm gonna say. So many guys tell me I can't wear rings. Hey, my hand's this, my hand is that. I'm not used to it. It's not my style. I'm telling you, once you start, just start wearing them and you will get used to them very, very quickly. And I will say you're gonna get a dick. I'm also wearing a bracelet and a necklace, right? So I got a lot of accessories because otherwise, again, we don't want it to be a basic fit. We want to elevate it. We want it to be interesting. And that's where the accessories come in. What is the one other thing that you can notice right now with my style in this video, in this frame? It's the hairstyle, right? It is the hairstyle. Literally all I have going on right now, t-shirt, accessories, and the hairstyle. So guys, when you're wearing a t-shirt and jeans, you have to make sure that your hairstyle is on point. Now, I would say that your hairstyle should be on point regardless, no matter what, but we know that once in a while, you know, you're not gonna do your best, but when you're wearing a t-shirt and jeans, you have to nail it. Because again, there's not much going on. It's a simple outfit. You have to make sure that whatever you're wearing, even though it's basic and simple, you do it well. And your hairstyle needs to be amazing. I have a lot of volume going on. You know, I got my Forte Series Texture Clay. As you guys know, I just cut my hair recently, so I'm still in love with it. This is fresh to me, this is new, and I love it. So get a fresh cut. Make sure that you're maintaining your hair at a length that you like, right? Unless you're growing it out, which is fine to go through the awkward phase. But make sure that your hair isn't growing over your ears. Make sure your neck isn't uh, too hairy because obviously people are gonna be able to see that with a t-shirt. All of this grooming is really necessary to make sure that you look your absolute best. Now, in a t-shirt and jeans outfit, there's one more element to that outfit that we haven't spoken about, and that is going to be your shoes. Because obviously, you're gonna be wearing shoes. What I would recommend is wear something that stands out a little bit more, depending on your t-shirt. If you don't have any graphics, if it's solid like this, if you're wearing solid jeans, you can always bring up the heat when it comes to the sneakers, man. You can wear some Jordans, you can wear anything that's cool, like the, the Dior Converse, those are so sick and they stand out, right? Anything that stands out, you might wanna wear that if you're just rocking a solid tee and solid denim. I would also say, don't confine yourself to just sneakers. Make sure that you're expanding your style. Try boots. Chelsea boots are absolutely amazing. We have uh, modern like combat boots, right? Military boots, they look really cool as well. They give you an extra inch or two of height. They look rugged. It makes you look like a man, right? I really love wearing boots because you can just take them anywhere. You don't even have to worry about getting them dirty. So go all out with the shoes to make sure that your t-shirt and jeans outfit is on point. Now, I would not go all out with the shoes if you have patterns and designs going on all over the place because then you just look like a newspaper clip and it's just too much. What I would say is make sure to keep the shoes very basic and clean if you have a lot of patterns and designs going on on your denim or your t-shirt. But have fun with it. You can definitely wear some nice clean sneakers and then get some ripped up jeans that look good if that's your style. You can also wear graphic tees to add some dimension to your fit. And the last thing I will say that completely changes your look when it comes to a t-shirt and jeans is your posture. Because if you're walking around like this, it's just not gonna look as good and it's so easy to see. When you have a jacket on, sometimes you can kind of get away with it. But when you're wearing a t-shirt and jeans, everyone can tell that your posture is not good. So make sure that you think about this. Be really mindful of your posture. Shoulders back, 
chest out. Imagine that there's somebody pulling you from your hair up here. That way you keep your head up at all times. Guys, today is the last day that you can pre-order ATOS Apparel, my new brand. It would mean the world if you went and checked it out. If you get three pieces, we're gonna give you a 15% off discount. And this is just a special discount because you guys are helping us launch this brand and it means so much to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm excited. I was so nervous launching this brand and we have so much in store. I can't wait to share more with you guys. This is our brand, like I said. I want feedback. I want you guys to tell me everything you want us to do with this brand, and we will do it. If you learned something new from this video, hit the subscribe button below and join our YouTube family. You can also find me on TikTok and Instagram. It's at Alex Costa. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Peace.